like, I can work with Jana anytime because we're going to laugh. We're going to enjoy each other's company. We're going to learn from each other. She is who she is. She's very honest, trustworthy. I had the fortune of being able to go to Goddard Public Schools from K through 12th grade because I was involved in a lot of extracurricular activities at school. As a matter of fact, if there was a chance to stay after school for something and participate, I was there. I played Toto to Jana was Dorothy, and I think it was because my limited French would only allow me to say Le Bark. But at any rate, so we got to, so we had a lot of laughs doing that. Other thing that I really appreciate about Goddard and that sense of community is I knew teachers and educators both inside the classroom and outside the classroom. Bob Macy and he was principal back in elementary school, and that was Lori's dad. Miss Wood gave me swimming lessons, and the other one was uh, Rick Kilmer. So I knew Mr. Kilmer uh, both inside and outside the classroom. You just don't have connections like that everywhere. Jana um, is a risk professional and, and a strategic risk professional. So she identifies emerging trends and risk and issues and provide guidance to her leaders. She forged a path, I think, for women that hadn't necessarily been there at least very um, in, very commonly in, in the past. You know, navigating the corporate world was beyond me, but for her, Jana had such a cool head. She had great people skills and able to navigate uh, uh, the corporate world. It, it, I was just very impressed with her ability to do that. I watched her in every job that, that uh, she had, even before we were at Kansas City Power and Light. Uh, she always made really significant contributions. People saw the difference, uh, you know, saw that she was, you know, she really added value. And so everywhere she went, she stepped up the ladder to, uh, to more responsible jobs. I was one of the first women uh, natural gas traders and actually joined the Natural Gas Association of Houston when it was still the Natural Gas Men's Association of Houston. I think what really out was outstanding or what caught my attention was her ability to pull ideas and information from others. She included everyone. Everyone had a voice. And so her ability to take all of these ideas and these personalities and build something meaningful um, for the organ for RIMS was just, I, I just thought it was outstanding. And whenever I reflect back about my time at Goddard, and I, I realize it today, but didn't know where it would lead at the time. You know, so I went to, to all the sporting events after school and hung around at, at after school. And, and so that experience of learning how to network and interact with people, to me, that's a lifelong skill. I want to tell her that I am very proud of her and that I think of anyone I know, she deserves this um, as much as anyone else. And it's really not one particular thing that she's done. It's just the fact that she has had a career that has really moved the needle truly for women in corporate America. And yeah. I'm very proud of that. And it all started at Goddard. <laughs>